Gonna do a little bit of a toolbox tour here on the Montezuma box I keep in my service truck. Uh, start with the wrenches, eight to 27, and then eight to 18 in ratcheting. Those are all gear wrench. Same with the SAE, quarter to three quarter, then quarter to inch and a quarter. Uh, going to sockets, seven sixteenths to inch and a quarter deep from Harbor Freight, 10 to 27 deep Mac for the half inch drive. Shallows are down here. Same sizes for the SAE, but the shallow set, I can fit up to 30 in this box. The whole set goes up to 36. The rest of the stuff that I don't keep in here, I keep in a box I carry with, kind of on a job by job basis. Uh, 7 to 19, 3 H drive, uh, corn wells, deep and shallow. Same set, inch, quarter inch to one inch, deep and shallow. Quarter inch drive, I have Matco ADV, deep and shallow. These are SAE, these are metric. These are semi-deep corn wells. Right here, I've got an uh, 8mm, 10mm flip socket. Then go over to the shelf here. Got a tech driver with a magnet, magnet tool, snap-on ratcheting screwdriver, my big cornwell hose pick, terminal tool. There's a mirror behind there. Bigger snap-on flat blade. I got a uh, Duralast beater flat blade here. Uh, standard Phillips snap-on screwdrivers. These are standard shanks with stubby handles. Uh, Craftsman pry bar, my picks. Small precision screwdrivers, 3 8 quarter. Half extensions, Schrader valve tool. 3 8 standard ratchet. One of the flex head Craftsman's. Flex head Matco 88. Standard length Craftsman half inch drive, die light for doing AC work. Uh, the rest of my picks, interior trim tool, scraper, all the bits for my ratcheting screwdriver. I've got a resistor here for discharging capacitors, headlight, uh, wire strippers and pliers, device grips are here for doing truck brakes. Side cuts, I've got a razor blade scraper there, plier wrench, cable cutters, long side cuts, uh, the adjustable plier wrench from Nipex, Cobras, regular pliers, regular needle nose. Over here I have a long 3 8 Mac ratchet and I've got the quarter and 3 8 kits and the small snap-ons. Then going back under the tray here, I've got two different size snap-on ball peen dead blows just a cheap dead blow hammer uh, OTC test light I've got a uh, Matco digital multimeter this bag has all my punches and chisels larger half inch drive Allen sockets got my SAE and metric crow's foot sockets power probe soldering iron the butane one I love that tool I've got one in both my boxes my metric Allen wrenches, the SAE ones. I don't remember where I put them. I got them out somewhere in the garage right now. Longer half inch drive Cornwell ratchet. Set of feeler gauges. These are SAE semi deeps. SAE metric 12 point half inch drive shallows. 3H drive 12 point metric. These are deep inverted torques, shallow inverted torques. This is an inverted Torx Plus 24 for taking beds off newer Super Duties. Uh, all my Torx sockets, 3 8 metric flex head, and 3 8 Then over here, I've got the quarter inch ones to go down from there. And these are all my universals, some adapters, O2 wrench. Uh, I've got a spark plug socket, twist socket for taking off lug nuts on Fords that are swollen. Um, back here, I've got my Allen socket my six point uh, semi deep metrics thread chaser for uh, Ford spark plugs six liter forward uh, wrench for the oil filter and that's about it there's some other miscellaneous stuff in here but this is kind of just what I keep in here for every day take to every job with me love the box it fits a lot more than I thought it would and honestly I can do most of my work just out of this